first of all, here you have a great energy. I've never been in a class with such a good energy. I think it comes from Anthony's way of not putting us in competition with each other. Everyone has his own specificity and is used for his own specificity. And he has a really interesting way of, of diving inside each personality and helping you learn the tools to take what you have in you that is your uniqueness. You know? So that's, that's special. I always had teachers that were like, oh, you're great, or you're bad, or you're this, but you were already in a competition mode. Voilà. That was the main thing. And tools that are, I mean, I did a, it was a week, and in a week I come out, I have, uh, uh, I came here because I was hurting myself too much, acting, working. I was, I was looking for things, not really knowing where I was looking. I was like uh, digging into pains and, And, uh, and sometimes it didn't work and I didn't have, and I come out with tools that I think I, I know I can use in my work, which is apparently didn't happen in the workshops before, so. But there's a way he has of working with, uh, even witnessing how he works with other people makes you see, um, I, what you could do differently in front of a text, you know? So you, you get a text and I know that now I'm going to read it totally differently. Um, uh, I don't know how he does that. Um, you know, you have like specific exercises like uh, uh, personalization was, a, was an exercise that I hadn't seen like that before. I, I'd seen it, but um, Uh, it was all, always very specific. It was always, you know, you find that thing that you put yourself in relation to and then you stick to that thing. And it was really good to see how you can go from that to something totally different and lighten up the text or take another direction from it or, yeah. Sometimes you have coaches, they make you dependent on them, you know? You, you need them. You have a text and you, shit, what am I going to do, blah, blah, blah. And here you come out, there's something that you learned that you have, you know. Now you're going to look at the text and every time you're going to look at a text, you're going to know different ways of attacking it and hearing it that you can use on your own. Voilà. <laughs> that makes any sense. Well, I can't really explain how he does that. The one thing I know is that he brings that feeling of community by not putting people in competition with one another, that's for sure. And um, by not putting himself as uh, a mentor, you know, not having an ego that goes in front. And a lot of teachers have that ego that comes, that what I was telling you earlier, which is, suddenly you get out and you don't know what to do because they're not there. He doesn't have that. He's more trying to work with you. And so the fact that he's humbly trying to figure out it, you know, the scene with you and trying to make it work with you and giving you the, his tricks without holding back on anything or, um, I don't know, I think that creates amongst people that same feeling of like, oh, maybe you could try that or, you know, ease, easier than if you have someone that's, uh, keeping all his little tools and just like playing with actors and pushing you without really showing you the the way he's been pushing you, you know what I mean? He helped me, he showed me people I could work with and um, I have, maybe I come out with more faith in working with people. <laughs>